are testing now for protein, bacteria, and then a cross-contamination test. I have a Hygiena ProClean Rapid Protein Residue Test. This is not provided by Norwex. It is a medical grade uh, tester that they use in restaurants and, and hospitals to make sure that things are getting clean. I have a Kirkland Whole Chicken with the juices already spilling into the bag. And I'm gonna pour this into the sink, which by the way was not cleaned last night, so it's already dirty. So, there goes the chicken juice, and then what I typically do when I make this chicken is I get it out, I rinse it off, don't use that please, and then I pour the juice out in the sink. Okay, this will get to cooking in a minute. Now, I'm going to take my microfiber cloth, folded, not scrunched, and I'm going to wipe all of the surfaces. Actually, let me, let's see. I want you to know which side I'm using so this doesn't seem like tricky, tricky business. All right, so here's our tag. Hold it. All right, so we're on the tag side. So I'm gonna wipe all of this down. Normally I would fold and use a clean side, but for the purpose of this experiment, we are gonna just use one side. Watch my time, Dorothy's gotta go to school. Cleaning, 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 nasty chicken juice. All right, so I'll set this down. This is our tester. And as I understand it, I take this out and I swab all over for the presence of protein. Protein is smaller than bacteria, and I'll provide a graphic with that, which is why we do that this way. All right, moment of truth. In it goes. I crack this. To release the solution. There it goes. And I shake. Nice. Parker, we're filming. Just give it a minute, okay? I shake. And what do we have? Green is clean, people. Green check mark is clean. Gray is an X. Light purple is an X. And dark purple is an X. That's the gradation of the presence of protein. You have to have the presence of protein to have bacteria. That is a scientific fact. I didn't know that I learned. Okay, so there we have it. Now kitchen cloth. Here's your tag. Let's test for contamination. I probably wouldn't do this, but for the purpose of science, we will. So I'm going to clean my countertop with the same side. There's your tag that I just cleaned raw chicken with out of my already dirty kitchen sink. Take my little swab back out. The tester's already in it. Go all over that surface. Both sides of your swab that I just wiped. Put it back in the tester. Moment of truth, people. Moment of truth. It is still green. Green is clean. Now, okay. you can see the green. Now, just so you know that this is not some bogus stick that doesn't work, we will now take this same swab and swab the raw chicken with it because it's already turning purple. In we go. We shake. Yes, you can see. And you can see that it's turning purple. The darker purple, which is the nastiest one. Not even the gray. So, 
that's really exciting because that's the first time I did that and that literally kept me up for two hours last night wondering if it was gonna work. So I'm really excited right now. Microfiber, Norwex Microfiber. I'm Carrie, I'm a Norwex Microfiber independent sales consultant. You need this product.